Hey guys, it's Ditsa and welcome back to Beauty Barn channel where we talk about everything K-beauty. From product reviews, skin concerns, solution, tips and guides, personalized routine to the latest trends in K-beauty world. Today we'll be diving deep into two products sharing the same key ingredients that is no surprise to anyone who is a fan of K-beauty or skincare in general. Can you guys make a guess? Yes, we're talking about the Snail Filter Secretion, also known as Snail Mucin. And these two products, both from Cosrx, got the world buzzing. We have everyone's favorite, the Advanced Snail 96 Mucin Power Essence and the new Cosrx Advanced Snail Radiance Dual Essence. Let's see and find out what makes them unique and how different they are from one another. Also, we'll be making an announcement at the end of the video, so stay tuned for that. Give us a thumbs up if you want to see more videos from us and if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, what are you waiting for? We are also on Instagram sharing free K-beauty content every day. So join the family by clicking on the notification bell to never miss out on our updates and stay in the game. Speaking of games, let the slime game begin! We've tested out these two products for a while to see if there's any difference between them. Let's start by taking a look at the packaging. They both come in this see-through pump kind of bottle, but unlike the first one, which is the original Snail Essence, uh, it has a normal bottle with the whole product in it. But the Radiance ones has a separation in the middle. It's got the Snail Mucin on one side and other ingredients like Niacinamide on the other, and the consistent look a bit different. As there's only one pump, it comes out together and you just have to apply it as it is. We're not sure what the purpose of the separation is. Is it to activate some ingredient or just an innovative idea? So if you know the answer, let us know in the comment section below. Let's move on to the texture. Off the bat, the Snail 96 Mucin is thicker and has more weight in it, while the Snail Radiance is a little bit more runny and absorbs quickly. Two pumps is more than enough to cover the whole face and another to apply in the neck area. They both leave the skin feeling hydrated without the stickiness, which is definitely a plus point. Because when you think about Snail, the first thing you picture is their slime. Ooh. Time to break down the ingredient list and their benefits. They both have 10 similar ingredients like snail mucin, which is the key ingredient, boosting skin regeneration, repairing damaged skin, hydrates, and brightens overall. Next is hyaluronic acid, which contributes to pumping up the skin and builds the skin hydration level, which makes them great hydrators. Then you also have panthenol and allantoin, which are both soothing and strengthens the skin barrier and few other humectants as well. What makes them different besides their packaging is ingredients like niacinamide, glutathione which are both brightening agents and provide anti-aging benefits only present in the snail radiance along with moisturizing ingredients like argania and macadamia seed oils. Now the final wording, which one should you choose for your skin type? In my opinion, they're both great essences and have similar benefits. They're both free of fragrances, parabens, harsh alcohol, and essential oil. But if you're looking to repair damaged skin needs an extra boost of hydration and moisture, you can go for the Advanced Snail 96 Essence. And if you're looking for an additional brightening effects to improve complexion, lighten blemishes, and slightly light on the moisturizer comparatively, you can go for the Radiance. You can even add them both in your vanity, which most of people do, like me. Hmm, so which snail essence do you think is best for your skin? Share with us in the comment section below if you've tried these products, did it work for you, and what's your take on them? Leave us a review and we'll pick the best comment and send you a gift. Winners will be announced next Saturday, so stay tuned for that. Also, if you guys like this comparison video and reviews, please let us know in the comment section as well. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye guys!